Well, <laughs> it's been a while since I uploaded, but and now I'm back. I've got a new monitor. I've got a new CPU, new motherboard. I changed my RAM. I got a new microphone. So yeah. What's up, guys? It's me Woken, and today I'm gonna show you how to improve your bad business slash Roblox performance. So the first thing you wanna do is go in the description, click on this link and make sure you download the blocks app version 2.5.3 and you do that by clicking here it's gonna download the exe file then you can save it wherever you want double clicking is gonna open this menu and the first thing you want to do is go to behavior and disable automatically update the block shop client so it doesn't update to a newer version because this new version has this option here that allows you to use Vulkan rendering mode which is far superior than the other ones so as I said you want to disable the update then you can install it from here there's gonna be an install button and you can install whatever you want then the first thing you want to do is rendering mode set to Vulkan and Vulcan is for newer graphics cards, let's say like 30 series, 40 series, NVIDIA and 6000, 7000 uh, AMD RX versions. Mostly newer graphics cards support this and there, it's gonna improve your FPS by a lot. Even my PC has a 3080 but it doesn't support this, I'm not gonna use it in this tutorial but you can. And also let me know in the description if, like, if you have issues with this stuff. The next thing you want to do is open this textures folder I'll leave a link in the description to where to download it You'll use this to nuke all of the textures from the game So I'll want to use this No Skybox, skybox uh, Low Textures What you want to do is press Ctrl A then Ctrl C to copy Then you go here and click import the JSON file and Ctrl V to paste You can change your frame rate from here uh, Blockstrap automatically uncaps your frame rate of the game You can you type in the frame rate you want to have captured I have 165Hz but I recommend you to have a higher value than your refresh rate by a little bit I want to use 300, click OK Click Yes and then save once you've done that you want to go in nvidia control panel and make sure your vsync settings are disabled you can check that by going to manage 3d settings and vertical sync and clicking off it's usually on use 3d application setting click ok then it's gonna click apply and then that's it next thing you wanna if you wanna make it as a safety measure you can open file location for roblox the blockchain client go to version latest version go to extra content and then textures and delete all the files in here except the sky and ui so leave only these two in here now we can go into the game at first go into a private private lobby you can already see that it did some settings because everything looks like low quality and stuff like that it's gonna help you improve your performance by a lot. Once you're in uh, Blockstrap client game, you wanna press Alt Enter, and that's gonna also increase your performance because through full screen. This is my frame rate. It's capped at 300. It's constant 300. And now, when I go into the game, you will see that literally everything has no texture. Like even the there's usually some other textures that the game can't remove by disabling textures in the settings but this config makes it so you get rid of all the textures in the game let me try another map so i can show you i can i'll also show you my settings i have everything here enabled and these are disabled it's mostly just for performance i'll leave a link in the description if you don't want to copy just like import the settings this is what i have here crosshair it's a custom crosshair this is the id my colors my outlines my gameplay settings and so on now when you're here on a map that has like those things that i'm talking about you see that there's no literally no textures as you can see here like only this brown thing 
also this config it's not gonna mess you with your what's it called with your draw distance the draw distance is changed from the graphics quality so you can have like no problems with this you have no issues as you can see you can run this at like one two three four six blockstrap gives you more lines of graphics quality so you can change it a little bit more to how you like it like you see like all of the icons and stuff like that low quality because of the config so yeah now i'm gonna jump into also this is my frame rate while i'm recording and also i'm not pressing alt 10 to go in full in like true full screen mode this is my frame rate right now before players are going in the game as you can see i get like 200 and keep in mind that I have a really high end PC and I'm getting on like 200, it's around that much. But the frame rate is more stable because of the, all of these settings. If you have like a high refresh monitor, a refresh rate monitor, you're gonna see a difference. So yeah, make sure you never use this skin because it's gonna ruin, ruin your frame rate the fuck out of it. Like 30, 50 FPS drop off just by using that skin or just even an animated skin is gonna ruin your frame rate so yeah never use it <laughs> thanks for watching if you liked this leave a comment ask me whatever you want in the comments i'll help you i'll try to help you and thanks to penile for giving me the the json file for the textures and stuff so yeah thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next video goodbye